Hey, hey, what's going on guys? My name is Matthew from Educoded and in today's tutorial, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to set up a new web application with Amazon Web Services. Um, I'm basically gonna start from the beginning. Uh, there are some prerequisites to getting this all you know, started up. Basically what you're gonna wanna do is go to Amazon Web Services um, or aws.amazon.com. I really don't want to like spend a lot of time talking about how to set all that up, but essentially you're just going to create an account. Um, once the account's verified, you'll be able to go into, uh, I'll show you guys, um, this console or dashboard um, and then click into EC2 and you'll go to launch an instance. So from here, like once you have all that set up, I typically use this Amazon Linux um, server. Uh, the the second version is good. I'm just a little bit more uh, comfortable with the older version of Linux. Um, so if I just go in there, I usually just pick the free version um, just to get everything up and running. And then like you can go back and, you know, change your settings if you want. Um, there's not really like a lot, if this is just for development that you really need to do, you can honestly just kind of bl uh, blaze through this. Um, the only thing that I really do is I add a tag uh, here. I'll just put in educoded um, for that. And then uh, as for, I guess, like the security group, I usually just leave this open because I like to be able to have access to it. Uh, where is it? All traffic. Um, I think this is good. Yeah, this all looks good. And then obviously we'll want to create a new key. This title is educated. Download key. And let's throw this here. Actually, for the sake of it, I'll just throw it on my desktop. And then launch instance. So the instance is currently being propagated. Um, it'll probably take like two to five minutes for everything to set up. Um, but in the meantime, um, you can pull up terminal if you have it, and then uh, we'll jump right into the next video. 